Welcome back everyone to another episode of Universe Mode. Now I got a lot of positive responses on the last two, so here you guys go. I got a total of 58 views on episode 1, 22 views on episode 2, which I really wasn't expecting at all. So, but tonight, we're going to put yours truly in a match tonight, alright? It is going to be your boy... The one and only, and I know I'm stealing that from Ricochet, but it's my nickname I had at first. Against, where's he at? Um, oh, he's all the way down here. Against the Drip God, Seth Rollins. It's just gonna be a match, no title match. Um, I will, however, this will be a um. So, ah, uh, I don't really know what. Hold on. What? I forgot about the, um, title matches. Did we even get a winner out of those? We did. Brock won. AJ's the United States Champion, which I could be in the line next. Your boy. Tag Team Titles. I forgot about that. Uh, I will start doing tag matches, and I will start doing women's matches. Um, but for now, we're just going to give the title to Alexa Bliss. She looks fine. And we're going to give the title to the Street Profits. Here we go. So, Raw is starting right now. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Monday Night Raw. Put away your case of the Mondays. We've got some hard-hitting action for you here tonight. Well said, Corey. I cannot wait to see what we get. Well, we're in New York. I don't know what part. I've never heard of that part before of New York, but whatever. We got Bobby Lashley versus Damian Priest. Oh, we also got Shelton Benjamin in the background. You guys don't know where I got that from. I got that from BDA, my boy Brennan Collins. Never met him before, but I would like to be a part of a Vibe video if they want to let me down there. Or they can come down to Cali if they want to. They can come down to Cali For Bobby Lashley, and film a video if they wanted to. Good. Big fan of Lashley. Um, now I am. When he was, uh, when he was a, a, a bad guy, I really wasn't. Um, but now he's in a rivalry with the uh, Omos and MVPs with Omos. Where's Shelton? Benjamin? Where's he at? A truly astounding physical specimen. It only shows like two people in the background on the stage, but it shows like three people. No? Okay. So last time I saw Damien Priest, he lost a match. A huge upset. He lost the match to Kira Tozawa, which I'm very concerned about. Maybe tonight he'll pull it off against Lashley, but Damian Priest was in that United States title match at Money in the Bank because Tozawa was attacked in the backstage area by Priest, and the general manager, a.k.a. me, had no choice but to put Damian Priest in that match, and yet he still lost. It was a match between Omos, AJ Styles, Damian Priest, and I forgot who else is in that match. Oh, who else is in there? I don't remember. Um, if I see, if I see him again, I'll um, I'll definitely know. But I don't, I don't know who it was. Bobby Lashley looks unstoppable. To make matters worse, the Almighty is not above launching an ambush out of nowhere. Lashley well, just accusation, Cole. pound and ground. Oh, and a big boot to Priest. Lashley well, just dominating his opponent so early on. Oh, here we go. And a power bomb. 
to Priest. Priest has not had a match one since the first week of Raw. Second week he lost to Lashley, and the third week he lost to Tozawa again. Um, by the way, um, I didn't record the second and third week because I was just like, you know, I don't want to see the pair of you. So, uh, yeah, but when the first week of, when the first week of, um, Raw, uh, there were lots of views, but that's fine. You know, I don't care about the views. I don't, why well, I do. And I, I, I do appreciate it. I do. I do appreciate it. Um, but my goal for this year is to get to 500 subscribers by the end of 2022. Let's make it happen, everybody. Let's make it happen. He's heading up top. Thinking big from the top. Size and agility is negated as he faltered there. Yeah, this persistent could be mission accomplished for Lashley. Oh, oh cutscene! 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 Right! Right hands! Oh! Priest! And this superstar picking it up! Trying to get away, trying to retreat. Watch nothing to do with this matchup. Looks like this superstar's trying to take a minute to replan their game. Or maybe, maybe not. Oh, maybe Styles, the United States Here's champion. The superstar throwing them back into the ring. The United States champion. Damian Priest is oh my God, was not even expecting that. That was a great cutscene. Didn't, wasn't even expecting that. Is imposing, but he's still mortal. Priest's opponent will have to find that weakness and capitalize on it quickly. And oh, well, actually, again, right the veteran. Oh! Right to the kidney. Golly. Climbing to the top rope. I risk bringing them to their feet with an elbow drop. Uh oh, oh, the power, the strength of Priest, oh, able Priest to that. reverses it. And now Priest gonna hit his move. Oh, is he stealing his move? He stole his move. Oh, wait, that wasn't a signature. That was just. Okay. Oh, but that wasn't even his move. He was still an Ashley fan. Stomping down. Oh, Lashley with good timing on the reversal. What was coming there for the win? And he kicks out of the pen and won. He still got more left. In the the Almighty Bobby Lashley ain't gonna lie down for anyone. Oh, Crazy reversal! Bang! Lord. So effective. Knocks him down. What? Okay, that that was a bit uncalled for. Making that shoulder a priority. That was a bit uncalled for. He went right into that turnbuckle. Dominating shoulder tackle. This match's brutality starting to show on him. At this stage of the match, they are clearly starting to feel the, the hurt lock. The full Nelson. Oh no, oh no, he's oh no, he's not gonna do that. He's gonna do this. Oh! What a move! One, two, three. Bobby Lashley wins the match. Here is your winner, the Almighty. And by the way, next week there will be a fatal four match to determine the number one contender for Brock Lesnar's. WWE Champion Lashley has advanced. Next week's Raw will have that. Oh, they're in a... Oh, no, they're not. Okay, it's a potential. It's a rivalry match high, though. That Oh, could it be about... Could it be talking about styles? Could we have a... a Okay, I mean, I don't really know. Oh, I, oh, I, yeah, I skipped that because that's a, it's a women's match. We don't do the women's matches only because they they don't have moves like the men. They they um, I, and I'm not I'm not being disrespectful or anything like that. I'm just saying that 
the guys matches are more entertaining and more <laughs> there's a lot more going on I'm just gonna say that no disrespect to the women of professional wrestling but the guys matches are a lot more entertaining and a lot more action okay no disrespect seven feet three inches tall four hundred pounds there's a minute down in his last match scraper has arrived the following contest is scheduled for one fall making his way to the ring from lagos nigeria weighing in at 400 what in the world aaron matthews what is he doing Aaron Matthews ambushing Omos in the aisleway. What is this? What is this? Oh! Aaron Matthews assaulting and viciously attacking Omos from behind. This is the, this isn't the act of a good person. This is the act of a coward. And Aaron Matthews. Oh, Omos. Omos capitalizing on that move though. Omos wants to get him in the ring. I'm sure that Aaron Matthews does not have that in mind. As you can tell, oh man. Rich in the arm. Oh, oh Omos! What a clothesline. Corey, I wouldn't be doing my job if I didn't ask. Even if there's no good answer. How do you side slam on the outside? It's all right, Cole. I wouldn't be doing my job if I didn't try to think of something. Omos is a physical marvel, but he's and also And just walking he away. Doesn't know all the tricks. He doesn't know all the little things that win titles and earn main events. Stay light on your feet. Exploit the inexperience. Maybe then you'll have a shot. He has a task at hand but prefers to be showboating right now. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. And guys, just look at the seven-footer. Aaron Matthews uh, attacked Omos on the high knee. And you know what that means. Omos is not happy about yet, that. Omos just stomping down. Slowly beating down Aaron Matthews. Aaron Matthews tried to, uh, tried to attack Omos on the high knee, but it only angered the giant Omos. Oh man! Omos also a Nigerian. Big boot. This match grinded him down a little. Omos putting those unique gifts of his to good use, wearing down his opponent. Oh, right to the side of And boot. And oh, and another one. Now. The right hands by Aaron Matthews. Could Aaron Matthews knock off the giant Omos? I mean, we've seen crazier things in the WWE, but can Aaron Matthews do it? That's the question. And he denies Omos. Incoming. What a four-arm smash. And the top row, nonetheless. Omos attacking the, uh, the upper body of Omos, and that is actually a good, um, oh, well, Omos. It's such a good uh, thing, but what I would do if I were Aaron Matthews in this situation, I would totally, um, go out to the legs. Oh, and that, and he, well, he listened to me for a second. Oh, that knee! Oh, and another one. Aaron Matthews tried. Tried to do anything there. Oh, Aaron Matthews. Elbow. Oh, and a knee. Right to Omos. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Bang! Rocking the jaw. Brutal knee right to the face. Unloads with the boot. Oh! Oh, Omos reversal. And Omos capitalizes there. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. Right oh! Left, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. He fends off the attack. 
And this might not have a pleasant ending. Hurled away. God. Wow. Oh, that's just disrespect right there. I kind of like it. Oh, man, what a boot. Aaron Matthews. Just dead lifting right there. The power. Super oh, human. He's absorbing some tough hits now. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Oh, high rake. That's not right, but effective. Oh, uh, a crack the dome, I think that's called. By Aaron Matthews. Man, just a multitude of strikes. Bang! Right to the face. And now, the signature move, the deep six by Aaron Matthews. And now, the finisher, can he pull it off? Can he do it? No. Almost tried. Almost tried, but again, the counter by Aaron Matthews. And now, the cover. He got him. Aaron Matthews defeats Omos. And is now advanced into the WWE World Heavyweight number one contenders fatal four way match. How on earth did Aaron Matthews do that? This victory is exactly the kind of statement I knew he wanted to make here. Oh no, Aaron Matthews again. Earlier on to the attack Omos in the entrance way. And now he's actually. What's he doing? Another oh, one. Now he's gonna target in the arm now. Bring him us up. And now, oh, oh man. And now, what's he doing here? Oh, and a and big a boot. boot to the side of the head. He's got him in the crosshairs. Uh oh. Carefully measured knee drop. Aaron Matthews sending a message to the entire and locker the room. The electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Oh, we got a rivalry, boys. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> Man, I'm Morgan beating Becky Lynch. We got, oh, Alexa Bliss beating Beth Phoenix. We're not going to play this one. We're just going to, yeah. All right. B oh, B oh I, I forgot. It was Big E. Big E was in the United States Championship match. Yeah, he didn't win either. Now I realize you guys don't hear the ancient songs on the video. I watched it back and uh, yeah, um, all Apollo. I don't think he's made a mistake here. Two hundred eighty-five pounds. They clearly weren't expecting Apollo Cruz going after Biggie. I wanted to see this match. I hope the ref doesn't call it off. I actually agree with you, Saxton. I don't think we're gonna see it. Tazawa hasn't even come out yet, so. Wait a minute. Yeah, I'm playing as Big E and I have no reversals. <coughs> Climbs back into the ring. I have no reversals, guys. Oh, there we go. Now I have some. Enough already. The mouth oh, relentless. God. Wow, Cruz throws a hard punch. You know, okay, bro, come maybe on. Maybe quite fast for his size, but he's still a big, big man. Speed is not his primary game. Come on, man. I came in for his opponent tonight. Reverse. Right, Corey, quick attacks could be the key to victory here. Stand I can't even reverse. Assault. Like, what is this game? Taking aim on the R. He's absorbed some damage already. No need to panic. He's still swinging. Unique offense. Oh, right to the 
kidneys. Golly. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Get to the ropes, forcing the break. A lot of damage done, but the ropes offer. I can't even physically reverse anything because. Yeah, it's like showing up way too early or whatever. Oh, right to the back. Oh, foot just Finally, I get it. Jeez, that was super difficult. Biggie and Apollo, this rivalry has gotten very intense. Actually, Apollo attacked Biggie in the match and went in the bank, which cost him the uh, United States Champion. So, really. You know, really? Oh! Biggie was well on his way to win, like but Apollo got... What? Okay. That's kind of stupid. The right way. Well, I, for one, don't see anything wrong with this. They need to put uh, promos on, like, uh, heel turns and face... Yeah, bro, 2K, if you guys are listening up, I want you guys to listen good. A lot of people weren't really impressed with the game when it came out, mainly me, be because you guys took out the, the perfect stuff for Universe. You took out turn face promo and turn heels and make tag teams and break up tag teams and, and, and promos that come call out, you know, and sub -prom promotion promos. You guys took all of that out and that's kind of what made the game spiral down into the ground. The, the game is still good. I appreciate that. But you guys need to put in that stuff back in. It makes Universe Mode way, way better than it already is. It's your boy. He hitting down for his match. Yeah, but 2K, seriously, you need to put this stuff back in the game. Because, uh, well, mo most of us don't appreciate that you guys have just neglected it once again. The moment this match was announced, the WWE Universe has expected a classic. I think it is destined to deliver. He's been demanding this match for quite some time, and now he is ready to compete. Okay. I was looking for a cord to charge my um a thing when I found it. Freaking Rollins has arrived. Well, certainly Seth Rollins has unmatched accolades, a championship resume, but a wardrobe that leaves a lot to be desired. Saxon, last time you saw that much drip, you called a plumber. And his opponent from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds. Seth Rollins! So he's been called the Kingslayer, right? The architect, the Messiah. How about we give him a new nickname, Mr. Delusional? <laughs> oh, bite your, bite your tongue, Cole. There is nothing delusional about this man. Seth Rollins has earned everything. It just happens. Yeah, his name is shooting, Mr. Delusional. Multiple universal and WWE title reigns. And your boy about to put Seth Rollins to sleep. You're looking at a well-traveled superstar who has seen a lot in the ring. With experience comes confidence. There's nothing you can throw at this competitor that could phase him in the slightest. He'll be looking to utilize that wisdom in this matchup. But he's got trouble on his hands in the form of Seth Rollins, who comes to the ring ready to extract his own personal brand of justice. Well, Rollins has this sick agenda for balancing the scales in WWE. He believes things from the heavens. Big time splash. Big time splash. That's what Larry's known for is high oh, flying maneuvers. Rope. Moonsault! That might be the best moonsault ever. I agree. Larry to taking it to Seth Rollins. Oh, and to Seth Rollins got the knees up. The, the veteran you see out of Seth Rollins. Oh, oh man. What a well, shot. Of things you can say about what makes Seth Rollins an exceptional what a shot. superstar. But what stands out to you in this match? Rollins on the other ring. Features his in-ring genius. When everyone else is playing checkers, Rollins is playing chess. I'm sure Seth's developed a no way. Yeah. Drop kick. 
Beautiful. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. The rounds with the jog kick, that was, that was pretty uh, good. Laying waste to the back of the neck. Well, he's looking to completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap. Very effective. He climbs into the ring. Nice calf kick. Great elevation. Nice kick to Rollins there. Is now what's he going to do? Oh! German oh, suplex! German. And Rollins nice strength from Larry there. If he gets a chance. And went for another. Sending one on got, got off the mark a little bit. Line okay, line okay, line Rollins. Down. Okay. Ouch. Rollins soars. Nope. Not Here's today. Right Not today, man. German suplex again suplex. to Rollins. Oh, man. Oh, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep. GTS. Night, night. And now, the combo. AA. One, two, three. Perfect combo. And the victory by the one and only. Larry has qualified for the match to face Aaron Matthews and Bobby Lashley and the mystery fourth competitor that will be revealed at the pay-per-view match. But Larry has made his claim known and he has shown that he belongs on Monday nights. That is going to do it for the video today. I hope you guys enjoyed If you guys did, smash that like button. Show your appreciation for the channel. We are on the road to 500 subscribers. Make it happen, everyone. And I'll see you guys later with another Universe Mode tomorrow on Saturday if I can. Because I'm having a party over at my house with my niece. But if I can, I'll get it out. I'll see you guys tomorrow. But this video uploads on a Friday. So it won't be up until Saturday. That's just how the PlayStation 5 works. I'll see you guys later. Peace.